Jesus fucking Christ, my uh, my dogs are are uh, whining. Whining a as lot. As they should be. And what? No, as they not should be. They are going kind of ballistic right now. As they should be. Bro, no, my dogs are like cats. They're like they all, they're always just like they bark cuz they always just like feed me, feed me. They just like yell. Yeah, that's what a dog is. Well, I mean, yeah, a dog barks, a cat just stares at you, angry. Feed my cat me, just pe- stares at me. <laughs> Feed me, peasant. My cat doesn't speak. He just sits there and looks at me weird. His, Their faces say, just say that to me. Feed me, peasant. Although, hold on, when it comes to your cats, I think one says, uh, one of them says, uh, We shall vote on what we eat. Is that what J- uh, Jerry says? Yeah, of course. So what does, um... What does Ben say? I hate Jewish people. Why do you still own that cat if he hates your kind? Who knows, man? He's he's kind of funny looking. Okay, then what does the third what does the third one say? You need to turn into Sailor Moon. <laughs> Pick any any line from the anime. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, take your pick. She says a lot. She speaks way more than she needs to. <laughs> What's oh hold on, what think of a line of her insulting Ar- Artemis? Um, can't fucking think of any off the top of my head. I could think of lines of uh, Mina assaulting, not ass- oh God, assaulting. Actually, no, assaulting. Like, now that I think about well, it. Well, she does do that too. Now that I think about it. Most of them do. Yeah. Ridiculing Artemis. <laughs> Oh, it'll eventually it'll eventually come to us. Anyways, guys, welcome back to Fire Emblem Fe Six: The Binding Blade. Last time we streamed this, uh, OBS just literally punted me down and just kicked me repeatedly for like hours. Yeah, that's an OBS moment. Yeah, certified OBS moment. So let's not let that happen again. Hopefully, because now we're on chapter six. Uh called traps so i'm assuming once we beat this chapter uh we're gonna we're gonna stumble into a trap no hmm. well, I'll, find, I'll find out what happened i already read all this we have to take over a castle now oh yeah this is your first game with roof tiles isn't it uh, you played the remake of uh you played the remake of fe3 instead of fe3 did, uh, did three houses of roof tiles uh, well, when you when you say roof tiles, like elaborate what that is again. The roofs here, you can't see under them until you open the door. Yeah, three houses had that. All right, then you know how those work. Yeah, I know how those work. I won't. Didn't FV eleven kind of have that too? No. I remember it some. I can't. I thought I could. Oh, I think there's some. like one map that has them or something. Anyway, last okay. Well, last time we left off, we were able to pick our uh, our units here. But also, hold on. Uh, where's uh? Oh, do uh do um Saul and Dorothy just like show up at the start of this chapter? Yeah. Well, that's they the chill. problem when you when you have your only guy in the group besides. M- M- <laughs> Got the first like hold on. Uh, when it comes to Sailor Moon R, the first, like, uh, what is it, ten, like, eight or nine episodes of just those two alien, those two green love-stealing aliens, that was, that's, uh, that is, <laughs> that is a, that Sailor is a, Moon R was a goddamn mess. Mess to, it, it was a mess. Oh, wait, let, let me also just say, like, I think it's fine, like, it's Sailor Moon, like, it's fine, but it's the worst out of, uh, it's the worst out of the five seasons, in my opinion. I mean, I think Super S is is pretty close, though. Soup. Okay, if you're. Okay, well, I'm I'm biased because I kind of like Super S. Well, you're wrong. So. I've been wrong before. You're always wrong. Thanks. Chat. Name a time when Nickton was right about something. 
Christ. And the, the joke here is that nobody in chat talks. Nobody knows. <laughs> Oh, that is uh, Roy, Boars, Ellen, Walt, Dick, uh, Shauna, Lou, Chad, Clarine, Ruck, Rupture. <laughs> Rutger ruptures the bones. Oh, wait, hold on. You mentioned before that, like, there's no blacksmith in this game, right? There's no blacksmith in this game. Okay, my next question is... Uh, aside from, like, selling what we don't need, or what we never needed, or what we, uh... You get quite a bit of gold in this game. How? Uh, chapters give you gold sometimes, villages give you gold, and you can sell shit. Okay. Um, and there's a lot of shit for you to sell. Okay, cool. Uh, this, this, this dialogue makes me think this is a thief. Yeah. Well, sneaking in here was fine, but there's nothing worth stealing. Hmm. The room to the north seems to have treasure, but the security is so tight. Are those footsteps? Hmm, that's a dark bishop. I trust everything is under control. Yes, our soldiers are, are stationed all around this area. Lead them into the castle and ambush them. Just as we did with Lord or Orin. Yes, sir. I want Princess Gunu... Guinevere, Guinevere alive. The rest you can do with as as you wish. Now go. Is Princess uh, Guinevere like? Is she even playable, or does she or does she like play the role of like Princess Nina from FE11? In the trial map, she's playable. I think I've asked this before. Yeah. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Hmm. Now this is getting interesting. Well, for once, we can get a good night's rest, Master Roy. I wonder. That man said he was Lord Arryn's advisor. Wagner? Does he bother you in any way? It's Is actually he... Wagner, but... You know, whatever. <laughs> Wagner? <laughs> no, it's Wagner. He... German. He seemed to be in control of everything, as if he owned the place. And we can't even go near Lord Arryn because he's ill. Uh... Yeah, I. Yeah, that is the second time I asked. I didn't. I forgot I did last stream a few streams ago, <laughs> or last. Come to think of it, you do have a point, Master Roy. Excuse, Excuse me, Master, me, Master right, Roy. You're Saul. You're Saul Goodman. There seems to be an awful lot of soldiers patrolling the area. I think we're being spied on. What? No. You noticed? Impressive. Show yourself, intruder. Hi. And who might you be? Ah, uh, we could talk about me later. You know, I was overhearing that Wagner guy's conversation in the main main hall. Why did she say main twice? <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> and they said they're going to ambush you guys. Lord Arn would never do that. Oh yeah, that person's dead. The dark magician assassinated him or something. This is vi okay. Jesus Christ. This person could have handled that better. Oh yeah, he's dead. He's so dead. Fucking dead indeed. And he's going to capture you guys and turn you into burn so they can so they can join up with them. Hold it, Master Roy. Don't trust people like this so easily. You can believe me or not, it's up to you. But don't come crying to me when you find yourselves in trouble. Roy, if what she says is true, let's set a trap. We'll pretend like we're leaving. If Wagner is after us, he'll do something to persuade us to stay. If you're gonna go inside, use the room in the north. That room leads to the courtyard. So you'll be out of here in no time. Good luck. Oh, Master Roy, where are you going? We will escort you into the castle. So please come this way. My apologies, sir. But I have just received a report of a matter of importance. Excuse us, but we must be going now. Oh, but I, sh but I sh surely cannot see you off without paying my respects and offering you a place to stay. Lord Arm would never forgive me for that. Please, Master Roy, will you not just spend one night here with us? Do not worry. I shall tell Lord Arm that you, myself, that you are not to blame. 
I ought to pay my respects to him anyway. Please show us to his room. Like I said, Master Roy, Lord Arn is ill and I can and cannot see you. I am sorry, sir, but if, but if we can't see him, then we have no reason to stay here. We are in a hurry. Excuse us, but we must be off. You are leaving no matter what. Then I have no choice but to kill you now. Everyone, attack! Kill them all, but leave Princess Guinevere alive. Damn, so they were after us. Sir Roy. Even if we escape this way, we'll just be attacked from behind. Oh, great. It's one of those reinforcement chapters, too. Yeah. Then we'll just take over this castle. Everyone, follow me. He just fucked off after that. Yep. Okay, door. Okay, Saul has mend. Yes. Um, he is a priest, and he's... priests are uh, not very good in this game. He's noticeably fast. Yeah. And Dorothy is an he is fast, but uh, he he doesn't have weapons until he promotes, and when he does, he gets the worst weapon type in the game. Light magic? Yep. Like, for context on how bad light magic is, um, the basic light tome uh -huh. uh, is 5 might and 75 hit. Alright. Yeah, so they basically have axe hits and sword damage. Which is to say that it, light magic is essentially useless in this game. Mm -hmm. But yeah, you get Saul and Dorothy. Dorothy's in, uh, an archer. Another archer? Yeah. Oh, wait, man, just because I don't want Chad to fight at all, and he's just going to open doors, I just Why can't... not? It's a well, good I... unit. He has, sure. he has, a sta he has stats. Yeah, I know he has stats, but I... They're shit, but, I mean, it's something. Yeah. Either way, I, I, gave, the, I gave his iron sword to Rutger, because I forgot to give him a sword. Damn. Alright, so, uh, you gotta open doors in this map. All of the rooms, except for the bottom two, have treasure in them. And the, the uh... So these, these two rooms don't have treasure in them. Yeah, those two rooms don't have anything in them. Alright. But the other rooms all have treasure, and that one on the left... Um... Up one. That one has a recruitable unit in it. Hmm. Alright. Uh, that... She's a nomad. Oh, so wasn't that thief we talked to earlier? No. She's not recruitable this chapter. Yeah, I talked to her in three different chapters with Roy. Um, this is the first one you can talk to her in. Oh, she's... Oh, it was that unit you told me about? Yeah, she's also an enemy unit, but she doesn't attack you. So huh. you don't have to worry about her fighting you. Well then, alright. She's uh, just made it an enemy unit so that other enemies won't attack her. I okay. <laughs> By the way, just a question: Is that her? No, that's Sue. That's the unit that you uh, recruit this chapter. All this noise, a battle. What is going on outside? Hmm. Dicky going front. Hold on. Okay. Do you do you remember the death battle of uh, Sailor Galaxia versus Beerus from Dragon Ball? No. No. Oh. Well, that was a bat death battle that happened. Death battle is a fucking trip and a half. Death battle definitely is a is a trip and a half. It's. I'm not one for taking them too seriously, but they are kind of, but they aren't very entertaining to watch. Yeah. That's kind of the point. But I completely forgot who won that death battle. Because now that I know, like, the entirety of Sailor Moon, I'm curious if Galaxia could beat Beerus. Probably not. See, I would say probably not, too, because, like, <laughs> you missed Oh, come on, that hits, but a 70 doesn't- from a sword doesn't hit? 
This game is garbage. <laughs> Bro. Uh, Roy. <coughs> Alright, cool. Bunch of mages we have to fight. You know what's insane to me? Okay, okay, I thought Beerus won that one. Thank you, Andrew. But speaking of which, <laughs> Andrew, when was th when did you uh when did you first watch like the first season of Sailor Moon, and then how long did it take you for you to start Sailor Moon R? I'm asking this because at, I'm asking this at like the uh, did Nathan watch Guts for, from Berserk vs. Dimitri? You'll like that one. I did watch it. It was pretty good, although I'm kind of shocked Dimitri won that one. Andrew, I want to know, like, when, when you watched uh, Sailor Moon R, and when was and how long did it take you for you to start, uh... Sorry, the first Sailor Moon, how long did you watch the second season? God damn it, I'm not talking. Oh, you are talking, that's kind of the issue. <laughs> like, thanks! Good, what was faster? You st I know you started... It's this here, I'm talking about like uh, when you first watched this first season. How long did it take you for you? How long did it take you to start the second season? Oh, I know that it was oh, it was a long while, which to me is insane because of how sa the first season of Sailor Moon ended. <laughs> yeah, in question. Do you do you like endings that like uh? Do you like endings where everything is reset and nobody rem nobody remembers any everything? No, no, I hate it. That's why I don't like the endings of uh, most of the Sailor Moon story arcs. Okay, well, no, the, the, the only time that hap that happened is like at the first season where everything's just reset and they don't remember everything. Hate it. Yeah, I, I don't like endings like that either, which is why it's so, like. So, like, once I finished the first season of Sailor Moon, I immediately jumped into Sailor Moon R. Just to see what happens next. Yeah. So, so the fact that Andrew, the fact that he stopped watching Sailor Moon after that baffles me, and it took him so long to watch R. That's that's all I was trying to say. Is that a general? Or no. Night. It's a regular night. Oh. Hey, that puck can work. Sure, that plot can work in some places, I think. But for me personally, I don't like it. And neither do I. My problem is that is that it's it did so fucking fast that it didn't really that it really didn't matter. Well, yeah, sure. Like, I well, I mean, like. When it went from the first season to the second season, a few months did pass after that. Oh, she has no more heals. She could trade off with the clearing, I, I guess. What the fuck, dick? I love Dick. I'm not loving Dick right now. What was that nonsense? You're not. A, you're not a fan of Dick. Not right now. He missed several times already. But like normally, normally, what do you think about Dick? Oh, cool. I mean, I like sword units. Yeah, but do you like Dick? No, I mean like they get back to Usagi in chapter in episode one. Okay, do I like Dick? Yeah. Do you like Dick? It's no. A very simple question. No. I don't understand you. What is there to understand? I think he's a cool guy. I like the character. Yeah, I asked if you like Dick. I said yes. And you to said that. no. I said yes to that. Then you asked again. Yeah, no. You said I like sword units. You didn't say anything about Dick. There are okay, other well, sword units in this game. Rucker's a sword unit, and Roy's a sword unit. Okay, you know well, what? I don't a, okay, like Roy. All right, all right. Okay, well, Dick is a good guy. 
Is that all you want yeah, to hear? Yeah, Dick's, Dick's cool. I like Dick. Yeah, I agree. Good to know that you're also a fan of Dick. At least the AI is a bit weird in this game. The AI is very weird in this game. But hey, it's better than FE4. DICK! Like, what was the point if you were just- if it just gonna get their memories back in the first two episodes? That's also a good point! That's also why yeah, it's I not- don't. That's also why it's not good. I don't fucking know, man. Oh, wow. HP and luck. Well, that was, uh, that was something. Once again, Roy does not level up strength. Yeah, he tends to not level strength. Like, that's- that's kind of one of the things that he's known for. <laughs> Thank God you hit Dick. You hit Dick hit hit his dick. Get dicked. Damn, get dicked on, dude. Alright. It's funny because it's like penis. You didn't need to explain it. We know what that I think it's funnier if I do. I think it's a lot <laughs> funnier if I explain it. <laughs> Okay, Roy still, has, still, Roy still has two uses of the rapier. Hold on. In this game, when a weapon breaks, does... Breaks. You don't get a broken weapon. It just leaves your inventory. Okay, then does, it on, do I auto, does Roy automatically equip the sword Yes, sword he now? will automatically equip the next one. Okay, cool. Um, I'm wondering what I should do here. Okay, I got, I got somewhat of an idea. I'm trying to remember. I think it was between somewhere in the end of Shadow Dragon and the beginning of Echoes. That what? Oh, that when you stopped watching. Okay, Walt, kill this man. <laughs> Walt, go do a crime. Go, Walt. <laughs> Commit murder. Kill. Yes. Defense and res. Wow, he leveled up res again. My Merrick hasn't gained any magic yet, but that's okay, because Yumi doesn't know what res is. Hi, Zenny. Hello. Guess what, Zenny? Roy still hasn't leveled up, uh, s leveled up strength. I told you, it's not gonna happen. One of he's, these a, he's what, like level 6 now and he's still at 5 strength? Level 6, 5 strength, yeah. Yeah, his right. level is higher than his strength. <laughs> Hold on, uh, D. Mend is, uh, oh, D. So, uh, actually, I could trade the, uh, Mend men staff to Ellen. So then, I go, I go right here. That is, uh, that is really going to be bad later. You don't say! <laughs> All right, yeah. So Rutger goes goes over here, gets this guy. All right, cool. Even better, he missed. This might be a bit insane, but I'm gonna do it anyway.
All right, let's see what happens. But other than that, that's how it. But other than that, how is it going? Well, I, uh, I've only lost one unit uh, thus far. But aside from that, everything is going pretty good. Even then, that Makai tree tree arc wasn't that bad. I wouldn't call it great either. Andrew, uh, that's unironically my favorite part of Sailor Moon R. The arc that's the most <laughs> the arc that was the most irrelevant is my favorite part of that whole season. Which is the very... entirety of R is irrelevant. Let's be honest. I mean, it's re it's relevant to the story because it adds Chibiusa, who is not one of my favorite characters, but because it's her, it's important. Okay, that doesn't mean I have to like her. Who did you lose? I lost uh, Lance. So I've killed I killed Lance. But honestly, I still I still say Lance would not have died if he just had three Dragonites on his team. Like I think we I think we could just collectively agree on that. I agree. Three Dragonites, a Charizard, a Gyarados, and what, was there just one Dragonair, or was there? A, oh no, it was an Aerodactyl. Am I right? Uh, am I right? Can somebody look up a uh, Lance's? Uh, I don't. It was something. Lance's team from like Heart Gold Soul, Soul Silver. Your is Gold Soul your, Silver. Your is Chibiusa. Mine is the breakup shit. It's not with the Pokemon puns. It's not app. It's not applicable here. Bitch, I will make it applicable. <laughs> This is my stream. I can do what I want. I can just kill Shauna right here and make your premonition come true, Moon. But I don't want to because I kind of like her hair. Oh, you have blue hair. You must be the leader here. I mean, am I wrong? She's got she's got blue hair. Roy. Yeah, doesn't. she does. Roy's got red hair. Roy is the enemy here. Is that not how uh, hair works? In that fire? is how it works. Yeah. Uh, Salamence, Gyarados, Guardchomp, Dragonite, Charizard, and Altaria. Instead and of Gyarados, Dragonite, Dragonite, Aerodactyl, Charizard, Dragonite. In Heart Gold and Soul Silver, is that a rematch team or is that what he uses in the cha in the champions? Uh... Um, that's in the in the rematch. He doesn't have three Dragonites. In, okay. in the champion, he has Gyarados, Dragonite, Dragonite, Aerodactyl, Charizard, Dragonite. Okay, all right. Okay, yeah. Moon, moon set. I set think set he set could set. use a few more Dragonites. Honestly, if he just used a full team, a full team of six Dragonites, then he would have been great. Yeah, he would have actually been like cool. <laughs> I mean, Lance, Lance is cool. I, I haven't played the entirety of Heart Gold Soul Silver yet, but um, so far I'm kind of enjoying it. I haven't seen Lance yet though. Try to lure that mage out. Dorothy, lure that sword guy out. Or, I mean, not Dorothy. Dick, go over there and lure that, uh... Lure that, uh, Merc out. <laughs> yes, Andrew. Oops, all Dragonites. Blah, bruh, Claire use Kingdra. I know Claire used Kingdra. Hold on, when I open this door, are there enemies in there or no? No. Okay. Whew! Right this other... piece of music was reused in FE7. Sounds very familiar, honestly. Suppose I'll take what I can while I can. Is that the red unit that I have to talk to? Yeah. For three chapters? Yeah. And Roy has to talk to it, her. It, yes, in all three. And it's not three chapters in a row. She just kind of shows up sometimes. And then you talk to her and she leaves. She also opens doors. So you can just let her open some doors for you if you don't want to use lockpicks. But um, she, but you she talk takes. To her. But she takes the treasure, though. I mean, if you if you let her, yeah, but you can just talk to her before she does that, and then she won't.
Also, because she's a red unit, you can block her movement, and she can block your movement. Oh my god, I, yeah, I was like trying to get around and, her, And, uh, if me... you- if you get your thief over to her, he can steal her lockpick. Oh, I didn't know she'd be at, at that side. Yeah. Look, after seeing an episode where Chibiosa befriends a living- a living, breathing dinosaur in present time, I literally said, wow, talk about jumping the shark. <laughs> See, that's- I mean, I- that's fine. I watched Gohan befriend a dinosaur in Dragon Ball before. So every, anything's possible. Okay, and I can't attack her. What if I just kill her? Oh, <laughs> uh, then you don't get to recruit her later on. I know. I won't. I. But yeah, if I won't. Kill if you her. steal her lockpick with a with a thief, she can't open doors or chests. And you get her lockpick, so you just get an extra lockpick permanently. That does sound like promising, sick. but my thief's currently. And you can on the sell. You can sell lock. Yeah, but you can rescue and drop people. Um, you can sell lockpicks for like twenty five hundred gold. Hmm. Let's go, Lou. Lou is actually pretty decent. Lou is he's, giving, he's not a bad unit. Lou is giving me decent level ups that Roy fails to do. Yeah. Um I mean the the first two mages that you get both have ridiculous magic growths. And look at Walt! HP yeah, Walt's, strength Walt's strength growth is shockingly high. HP, strength, defense, and speed. I don't yeah. know about that one, Nick. Okay, well, I'm I'm biased because I because I Gohan's my favorite character in Dragon Ball. Walt has the same strength growth as Roy, but he just gets it more often in my experience. Okay, that's bullshit. Oh, wow, Lou also has the same magic growth, forty. Uh, but I know that the, the next mage that you get has a 75 magic growth, but no base HP. Uh, so, damn it. I'm you know, trying she, to lure she's that... a glass cannon. I'm trying to lure that mage that's in there out. Do they not come out? Which mage? The mage up here. Oh, uh, you're not in this range. I was until uh, this red guy was showed up. Oh. I mean, they should, but... Probably because that red guy moved first, so you weren't in this range anymore. Okay, so so far, Walt is kind of sl Walt is kind of my best unit, but he's held back because he's an archer. Yeah, that's kind of how Walt is. Like he's he his stats are not the worst thing ever. Uh, they're not the best, but they're not the worst. But he he is an archer, which means he doesn't do anything half of the time. Ah, gold. Yeah, I told you, you get a shit ton of gold in this game. Okay, I will attempt. Wait, hold on. If I don't. That's if I don't talk to her, right? Uh, what? Um, I'll attempt to have, like, Chad try to steal her lockpick, but if I talk to her, then she just goes away? Uh, no, she'll start to, like, leave the map, but she doesn't just immediately disappear. Okay. Yeah. Ouch. Whoa, game's lagging a little bit right there. Nope. Nick, are you trying to do a rank run with this? Because you sure are leaving your He's not. <laughs> No, I'm He's not. not. If I was, I've already failed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow, she's fast. Dorothy, yeah. you can do it. She has she has a uh, very, very high speed set. Nice. God damn it, Dorothy. Fine. We love you, Dorothy. So you want to know what's funny about that? What's funny about that? Um, stairs. I don't remember if the if engage or three houses do this, but stairs are reinforcement points, basically. So she just opened a reinforcement point. Is what you're telling yeah, me. she just opened a door. It's gonna spawn a shit on a reinforcement. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, we we love Kath. She's a very uh, 
useful person. She's definitely not just screwing you over unintentionally at every turn. Uh, that, that's exactly, that is exactly what she is doing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Roy lives, but, but only just. Okay, finally they start moving forward. There's no weapon triangle for tomes in this game, right? Uh, there is. Oh, there is. Um, dark beats anima, anima beats light, light beats dark. I will try to... Th I will pretend I understood what you just said. Okay, light magic. Yes. Is strong against dark magic. Okay, yeah, I f yeah, I figured that. Dark magic is strong against anima magic. What's anim anima magic? Uh, like the elemental magic, fire, thunder, uh, air caliber. Oh, okay, Excalibur. okay, okay. It's just the okay, the other elements. Dark is strong yeah. against all those. Yeah, and then those are strong against light. Okay, now I get it. All right, enough. Uh, yeah. Don't. No more uh, opening chests, Missy. Hey, you're. Oops. Wait. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Let go of my arm. Ow, that hurts. Oh, I'm sorry. But I hate what her. are you doing here? Well, um, you know, it's complicated. I have things to do, you see. <laughs> things to do. He things to do. Here, in a battlefield. Dummy, it's because this is a it's because this is a battlefield. Oops, better watch my tongue. Do you have some motive that we're unaware of? Oop. Wait. Is it that you told us the escape route? Uh, what? I have no idea what you're talking about. Who are you? Now, now, don't worry about such trivial things. Oh, I gotta go. Bye. Hey, wait! Wow, what a useful conversation. I really enjoyed that, did you? Yeah, I thought it was really nice. I thought it was very, uh, very useful and fun, you know? Very, very good. The right answer is I did not like what I was listening to or reading. <laughs> Thank God he can reach him. Oh, and question. If I put somebody here, then will the reinforcement just stop? On the stairs? Yeah. Okay. At least that, at least that, uh, that's still a thing. Yeah, that's always a thing, and it's always very useful. <clears throat> now, to not let her escape the chest. Oh, sh so we can't let her escape the escape. No, she can escape. You just don't get the, the lockpick that she has if she does. Okay, yeah, that's what Because, I'm you know, you can't steal that's it from her if she comes off the map. That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. That's why I brought Chad all the way over here. That's why this chapter's going to take just a little bit longer, because, uh, well, you know. Well, it could also take a little bit longer if you want to just get all the treasure. Well, that's what I'm also trying to do. Yeah. I mean, Chad's here. Get, and, where and is she going? Too. She's going up to try and escape the map because her exit is blocked there. I don't know, man. She's Her fucking AI is weird. You know that you can just rescue him and move further with him, right? Yeah, I'm aware. That's what I did. I, that's what I did because I was... I said, let her escape. Read, Nick. Read. I want to take the lockpick, though. Then let her go down. You're, you're blocking her path down, so she won't go down to you. I was not aware that I was blocking her path down. Oh, yeah, you're standing in front of the, the one tile stair there where she can't get through. I almost just did it again. Yeah, you, you're still doing it again. You just did it again. Not if I move Roy. Also, you can take uh, Chad and drop him. That way he doesn't have to wait a turn. I, I am taking Chad. No, you can drop him. That way he doesn't have to wait a turn. Oh, I, I, I see. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, there you go. Now you're understanding how rescuing works. <laughs> Take dropping is the most useful uh, thing in this game. 
Hi he, there, Vagna. He doesn't move, right? No, he doesn't move. Flux. Yeah, basic dark magic. 14 AKA attack. the longest animation in the goddamn franchise. Seriously? <laughs> yes, the flux animation in this game is like six whole seconds long. <laughs> and you block her path again? No, I didn't. It's she really get... funny. No, she can go there. She can get. She can get out. Yeah. Will these guys move forward? Those guys, yeah. I trust Saul can take one hit, maybe. What? I thought you said. I thought you said if I block um, the stairs. I thought you said if I block the stairs, they won't. I thought you could. I I thought you could in this this map. Some maps you can. Some maps well, you can't. I well, thought this was one of the ones where you could. Well, well bye well. bye, Dorothy. Oh. Okay, now I restart. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> it never happened. Okay, but this time I'm gonna have Chad. What never happened? This time, okay. This time we're just gonna have Chad down here just to take the lockpick from her. Just casually pressing speed up. You don't mind that I do it, right? I mean, whatever happened. No, not at all. It didn't, not at it didn't all. happen. It didn't, whatever happened. Nothing. What do you mean? This happen. is our first time trying the chapter. That is also that is entirely true, indubitably true. It never happened. What? You keep saying it never happened. What never happened? I'm very confused. I'm quoting that guy with like that. Uh, the he's at a table. And he just always says, "We made it up. We made it up." This thing was written by a writer. It never happened. It never happened. Like, true. Have you, have you seen that clip before? No, I have not. Uh, let's look, just like look up. It never happened. Or, sorry, I don't think sorry. I will. Look up. We made it up. We made it up. I'm gonna take his rapier. What? Oh, right. Forgot. Whatever. He can kill him. Oh, he, he'll die first. Actually, maybe not. I don't know why chat's freaking out. What happened, guys? Um, Dorothy and Shauna dying. I thought that didn't happen. It didn't, but they're expecting it to, because it just seems like something that you would do. You know what? True. Although when it comes to Dorothy dying, I was told I was told misinformation. <laughs> Me when I spread falsehood. <laughs> False information. <laughs> <laughs> I think Rutger's gonna die. I might have to restart again. Never mind. They went after Walt. What if the AI is stupid and just, like, goes after a waltz with a javelin? It very well might. AI is weird in these games. Okay, it didn't. God damn it. Okay, now I remember, now I remember what I did the first time. I hate the both of you. <laughs> That's okay, Moon. I hate me, too. Somebody... I also hate you, Nick. I at least at least somebody hit somebody there. <laughs> I hit my microphone by accident. Hey, strength, speed, defense. Let's go.
Okay, well now, okay, well now, now that I have, now that we have looked up what happens uh, with the stairs in the free, free reinforcements, we definitely need to take her lockpick. Okay, nice job, Rutger. Man, why won't you rupture rupture the foes? I hate these hit rates. <laughs> oh, you shouldn't get hit this time. Same level up, good. Okay, now Roy's at full health, which gives him more uh, more health to deal with um, deal with this guy. And even with Rapier, this just still does not kill him. Roy is so unbelievably weak. Roy sucks. Yeah, Roy is genuinely horrible. Which just vehemently upsets me. Alright, who am I going to kill this time? It's going to be Roy again. Alright. Come on! Just kill that one guy! That's all I'm asking for. Just kill that one guy. In one round of combat. Hey, Walt, you go forward, because Roy literally cannot do anything. That man is now dead. Murder. My favorite. Roy is overheated. Do you mean to say overheated? Or did you actually mean to he say He is definitely not overheated. His stats are... Genuinely unusable. <laughs> Stop bullying. Okay, so you mean do mean to say overheated, overheated? I mean, I like Roy as a character thus far, but as a combat unit, I think we could be we'd be better off not using him because he's not good. Six Roy level ups, not one strength growth. And the and the gross that are growing are just like unusable. I don't need a high luck growth. I would like that for an archer, not for Roy. Literally, the best thing Roy's gotten thus far is a is a res growth. Yeah. Nice job. See, that's a level up I want Roy to have. But he doesn't have it. And it's upsetting. And let me reiterate again. I like Rohe. Like, thus far, like, from the dialogue I've been reading, his character is, like, noble. He's, he's, he's a good boy. The Armor Knight gets skill and speed. And even defense. And Rohe cannot help, help himself to not get any of those stats. 
Oh, Roy isn't allowed to get stats. Didn't you hear about that law? It was uh, passed a while back. The law is stupid. Maybe. Who agreed to allow laws to exist? <laughs> <laughs> I think we should just stop paying attention to laws. Yeah, because nobody <laughs> pays attention to loitering anymore. True. What about you, bow boy? What are you in for? Loitering? I picked the most boring. I can boring. imagine going to jail for loitering. I can, actually. How? I'm, I, I was kidding. Yeah, I'm putting you under arrest. Uh, what, officer, what did I do? You're doing uh, nothing. You stood still outside of a restaurant for too long. <laughs> you did nothing wrong. You did literally nothing, and that's what you did wrong. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, well whatever. There you are. We didn't mean to fast forward that much, but then again, we've already been through all this. Where'd you go? Give me your lockpick. Alright, uh, still have Dorothy go forward here. Walt, do Walt things. Do things Roy could never do. <laughs> Am I asking for too much? Do things for do things that Roy never does. Um, I think that's most things. So no. Okay, Rutger ruptured the enemy, and he died. What does he get? Okay, HP, but still bad level up. <laughs> level ups just don't exist, do they? No. They, uh, they really don't. How am our units supposed to grow if they get nothing in return? Okay, that hurt. There we go, she moved forward. She didn't steal, she didn't steal anything from her, did no, Okay, good. That's Saul. Yeah, that's Saul. God damn it, Thani. Shana, whatever. Alright. Talk again. Skip. Alright, we, we got through that. Perfect. Now, let's just get through the rest of this chapter. What we should have done earlier had stairs functioned like how they should have should always function. You block off a staircase, that should block off reinforcements. Thank God this guy's weak. Okay, where is she going? There's no way we blocked off her exit. Not like it, ma not like it matters. We took her lockpick. Nice.
Well, I'm just gonna st I'm just gonna not have Roy move. That's what loot too much there again. Well, at least Roy did not die, luckily. Now here come the mages. Why isn't that one mage attacking? I don't understand. Who the fuck knows, man? Alright, good. He's finally dead. Alright, Chad, do your thing. Okay, another Volt level up. This time it is HP defense. Up a level increased, and he's level 7 now. Oh crap, I forgot about those guys. What is this oh, man? this map is such a mess, and I love it. What is this man's... Okay, this man has good enough res. This man has no res. But he does have vulnerary. Never mind, he went after Dick instead. Good. He, he went after I love his... dick so much, man. <sighs> I thought he was gonna eat my dick. Why isn't the armor knights attacking? I don't understand this AI. What do you understand? We're in their range. You said they move and they're not moving. I don't understand. Yeah, don't worry about it. Doesn't the armor knights not move? <laughs> I thought they did, and I thought I was and I was Told that they did. Evidently, they do not move at all. I mean, that just seems like it's on them, you know. I ain't nobody got time for that. <sighs> all right. Ah, shit. What's his attack? 14 attack. No, anyway, I can rescue. Dick's just gonna kill this man. Imagine getting killed by Dick. Disappointing he didn't do enough dan didn't have enough strength to one-shot him. No matter, though. No res. Oh, he's gonna kill him. You sound so happy about that. I am very happy about that. No res. Lou is fast enough to double attack. I'm very happy about that. <laughs> I'm so happy that this guy's dying. <laughs> this man is finally gonna die. Hallelujah.
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay, now I gotta waste several turns unlocking. This is this is also a seas chapter, so Roy's gotta get up there too. Yes. They are all seas chapters. Alright, so let's take a bit. Gold. Skill and luck, cool. Oh shit, reinforcements. Okay, that's a bit of, that is a little bit of a problem. These people are a little bit of a scallywags. No matter, we can take we can, some of us can st still can still take care of them. You know why we're gonna take care of them? Because I have two men named Walt and Rutger. I'm personally more of a uh, Wilt guy. Oh, his name's supposed to be Wilt? No. Just, you know, Will won't. Will, Wilt, Wilt. Oh. Huh, <laughs> wordplay. Funny. Yeah. Yeah, I thought that one was good. I'm uh, happy to know that you appreciate that. <laughs> what do you grab? Holy crap, okay, I got a Silver Lance and a Killer Axe from these chests. Some of this actually has to come off so he can grab more shit. Alright, now let's see what we're gonna do here. I would not cry myself to sleep if Boars dies because I hate armor knights, but I will try to keep him alive. Because he's because we, he's, he's gotten better stat level he's ups than Roy does. He's surprisingly useful. He's gotten better stat level ups than Roy has gotten. Yeah. Okay, cool. He one-shotted him. <sighs> Better call Saul. This guy has no defense. <laughs> Poor him. Rucker? Or the, the enemy? The, the enemy. Because Rucker just, has some defense. The enemy I just annihilated. Yeah. I was going to say Rucker has, has some defense. It's not much, but it's something. Speed, defense, awesome. Fire broke, so now Lou does not have a weapon. That's not great, but it's not the end of the world. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. And some people join the chat. Hello, everybody. How is everybody doing? This chapter is taking going on longer than I had hoped. Because of some uh, inconveniences with nothing happens. No, nothing happens. Well, no, I'm just gonna say inconveniences with stairs. It's like stairs got in the way of everything I love. Oh yeah, I hate stairs. It took us a long time to walk down the stairs. You know. 
You know how it is. Yeah, stairs are the cause of everything bad in this game. Uh, I want to find the guy who invented stairs and throw him down those set of stairs. I w wonder if Poe, if Poe ever just like looks at the. I wonder if Poe looks at the guy who invented stairs and just goes skadoosh. Skadoosh him. Skadoosh. Holy crap! He attacked twice. Yeah, he does do that sometimes. Believe it or not. I didn't believe it or not. Well, you did believe it or not. It's you did the not part. Want to learn how to tie your shoes? It's a very easy thing to. Do. I'm sorry. You, you said not, and I just automatically start singing the sh the sh the shoes song. Something's wrong with you. Why is something wrong with me? It just is. You ever just like look at your shoes and just start singing SpongeBob? No, literally never, actually. <laughs> Zero times. Okay, good news is these guys are kind of weak. So that's good to know that most of these enemies are fucking weak. A short bow. Dorothy, what the fuck? Thank you. Hey, my microphone. We're taking our sweet at time with this chat because we're trying to open because I'm trying to open all the doors and get all those chests. It's the um, innate urge of all Fire Emblem players. Open when we see doors and chests, we have to open them. Are more enemies going to are, are more uh, reinforcements good? Oh my good golly gosh! <laughs> I just answered my own question with that. Uh, I love this game. I want to throw this. I want to. They, they really just said, you know what? Why not? <laughs> we could put some enemies here. No, you couldn't. I don't know, man. Game seems to disagree. Who thought? Th okay, so that means there's enemies in here. No. I Actually, there might be, but there's also there is a chest in there. I don't think I believe you, honestly. Like, I hate to tell you, I don't think I believe you. That is fair. If somebody dies here, I will cry myself to sleep, but I'm not going to restart if it's somebody I don't like. Also fair. Good thing he missed. Oh, thank God. For fuck's sake. It's okay, it's only Dorothy. Nobody gives a shit about Dorothy. Why are there enemies locked in a room? I mean, I know Don't why that's it. happened before, but oh my god. That is so infuriating. Don't worry about it. There's plenty to worry about. If in case like you... what? That... Name one. Name one of the things. Well, I lost another unit, not, and I know I'm going to get grilled for it later. That's number one. Name another one of the things. <laughs> when you realize, oh shit, that's actually a very good reason. <laughs> Bet you don't have two reasons. It's anno- it is really annoying. Is that a good enough reason? No. The fuck you mean, no? I, I mean, no, it's very basic English. I don't know if you've heard that word or not before, but that's like... The I English language is inconsistent as balls. I mean, that's true, but that's besides the point. Oh, 
All right, I'll I'll definitely restart if they kill my man Walt. Oh, you have to for Walt. Come on. Weapon weapon level has increased. Great. Somebody clip somebody a uh, clip um me saying no. are there gonna be any more enemy reinforcements and then I open the door and then there's enemy reinforcements. I won't. Somebody else can. Somebody else can. I'm too lazy to do that right now. I just don't feel like it. One shot at the ridiculous fire mage. God damn it. Okay, tell me right now, are there good are there reinforcements in here? No. There's a, a unit that you can talk to with uh, Oh right my god, thing. this whole time I could have gone a fucking bow knight? Yes, I literally told you this at the start, that there was a nomad in that room. Sorry, also it's been, it's been a while. fun it's reminder dark. that nomads in this game aren't mounted. They're not, they're not considered mounted units? No, she is not mounted. Um, you can look at her, and if you look closely, you can see that she's not on a horse. That looks like a fucking horse. I don't know about, I don't know now, about re you. Read the description of the nomads. Wandering nomads, not wandering nomads who snipe their enemies from horseback. Uh, that's a lie. Um, so, horse slayers and the uh, Zanvato, which is a horse slaying sword... Do not do effective damage against her because they fucked up on the programming. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, all nomads in this game, all bow knights, uh, just are not considered mounted. And who has to talk to her, Roy? Yes. Okay, Roy, come on down. Oh, hi, K Kaith. I forgot you were here, honestly. Chillin'. You like the three ends? There are three of them. <laughs> okay, after we get those two freaking uh Thank you, Dick. After I get those uh, Oh, those I love two, Dick. Those two chests, then I can, I can finally end the game or end the chapter. Wish I had a brave sword. Same, but like in real life. <laughs> I wish I had a brave sword in real life. Yeah, I just think that would be really cool. Wouldn't it be cool if I just attacked twice before some nobody else can and kill them? I think oh, I didn't say anything about killing. I think that was on you, and uh, you're legally responsible for that now. Yeah. Uh, but. Yeah, I um, I just think it'd be cool to to have a sword that makes me do things twice as fast. Which means if which means if uh somebody dies due to a brave sword, uh, they're gonna look towards me. You first. blame Nick. It, it was Nick. If somebody dies, blame Nick. He's suspect number one. He's uh, guilty. Um, Sue is a decent unit. She's held back by the fact that she uses bows. I can't give you exa exact statistics, but from what I know, Sue is at least a competent unit. The other downside is that if you want to go uh, Ilya route, you can't really use her, but... So f okay, so far in this game, I have reason to believe bows are superior towards Roy. Um, everything is superior to Roy. You aren't a person like, from the castle. Like, literally everything. Who are you? Oh, my name is Roy. I am Sue. Are you causing the noise outside? Noise? The noise of a battle. Oh, yes. We're fighting dissonance of the castle. It's a long story. I see. Then I am on your side. Question mark. This castle's residents are, are my enemies as well. What? What do you mean? Please give me a bow. I will fight alongside you. We don't get any answer? No. She's 
She kind of has the same strength stat as Roy, which already upsets me. Yeah. Okay. All right, now let's kill this man. Oh. Uh, we gotta go by. Oh wait, Saul's here. Saul's here to right all the wrongs we end up doing. He's good. He's a good man. Damn you, useless yeah. vassals. Well then, I have no choice. Witness my magic and bow down before its power. No, I, I will not. I, d I actually can't see your magic. I'm closing my eyes. Uh. Yeah, you like how long that animation is? It's like you just spawned a jellyfish to sting me. Yeah, but do you like how long the animation is? No, I don't believe I like it. <laughs> if I'm being perfectly honest, I don't think I like an it at 80 all. 80-year-long animation. <laughs> oh God, it will hit rate is trash. All right, if I hit again, he goes... I go away for 20 minutes. Andrew, a lot happened in 20 minutes, none of which I'm proud of, but it's clip-worthy. You'll, you'll find out if you, like, scroll back. God damn it, Walt. Huh, that finally hit somebody. Okay, Andrew, to summarize, I asked Yang if there was going to be any more reinforcements as I was opening this door. And more reinforcements showed up and killed Dorothy again. Sorry, not again, for the first time. So, we, first lost, time. so we lost Dorothy. Which... I'm upset that's how she died, but I'm not but I'm not going to restart for her. Well, one of these days you got to hit. Where is she going? Who the fuck knows, man? Come on. It's making the loop. Thank God. No, my plan was flawless. No, it wasn't. What even was your plan? <laughs> if your plan was to, if your plan was to annoy the absolute shit out of me, then you've succeeded. I think he still has a short bow. Yeah, here you go. No money. Uh... Is that how she's getting out? What the? She's oh, going she, in she's a just, circle. Yeah, she's just vibing. Well, she's not allowed to attack you. So she's just kind of like. <laughs> so you're the. Oh my god, it's Lynn. The... So you're the grand. What? <laughs> oh my god, it's Lynn. She's in this game for real. So you're the leader of the <laughs> granddaughter. So you're the granddaughter of the leader of one of the clans in Sakai. Grandpa is the strongest warrior in Sakai. People call him the Silver Wolf. The Silver Wolf. I have, I have heard of him. Roy needs to see his throne time. Oh. But what are you doing in Lycia? Sakai is to the east. Burn invaded Sakai, so we... So we of the... Katola clan? Uh, Katola, yeah. Katola clan have decided to fight. So Grandpa let the woman and children escape to Lycia, but... But? There was a traitor. The... The... Jute. The... Okay, the D silent then. The Jute clan, who have turned to burn side, ambushed us. We were all separated. I found my way into these lands, and I was rescued by Lord Orin. Orin. But his advisor, Wagner, assassinated Lord Orin and took over the castle. And then you were captured. Is your army fighting Burn? Yes, 
Burn has invaded our lands as well. Then let me go with you. Fighting Burn will let me rescue my grandpa. I also want to avenge Lord Orin. We're headed for Ostia. It's in the opposite direction of Sakai. So, is this okay? With you? I don't mind. No matter where we are, neither our mother or the... F neither our mother, the earth, or our father, the sky, <laughs> will ever disappear. Master Roy, the spy I sent to Ostia has just returned, and he says that Ostia is in a state of chaos. What? There's been a rebellion among those who want to surrender to Burn. Is Lelena safe? The spy says that she has been taken as a hostage. Currently, the rebel group has taken over Castle Ostia and are fighting the soldiers who wish to retake the castle and Lady Lenina. We must hurry to Ostia. Lenina, please be safe. Alright, now we're getting somewhere. <sighs> Hearing of the rebellion, Roy hurried his pace towards Ostia. According to the information that he had gathered on the way, on the way, General Legans, uh, Legans, yeah, one of Lord Hector's advisors, had started a rebellion with Lieutenant Devious. Oh my God, Lieutenant Devious! Look at that man, he is Devious. Tell, sell Ostia to burn. <laughs> Lilina had been captured and taken hostage by Legans. She was then in prison inside Castle Ostia because Legance thought that he could use her for something later on. This hell of a map. Good luck, Nick. Oh, great. <laughs> this is the best map in the game. Um, and I, I mean that very genuinely. This is a sick map. Hearing that report, Roy and company entered Ostia in an effort to rescue Lelina. Ostia, the largest and most active city in Lycia, was to become a battlefield. Stained with blood. This is Thracia map if it was on G on the GBA. Oh, remember uh, Thracia Chapter 6? It was kind of this, but... I can pick up the 13 units. Yes. And uh, you get, a like, five more this chapter, so... Oh man, I think you get a uh, useless girl that everybody likes for some reason this chapter. No, um, you don't. Never mind. You get her way later. You get her in two chapters. Are you talking um, about Mia? No, that's that's uh, basically the same character, but from a different game. I'm talking about Fur. I mean, I know why people like Fur. Are there any chests cute, but... on this map? No, but there's a shit ton of villages. Uh, and an arena. Oh, there are... Oh wait, these are these are. Open. Oh, those are there are two chests, yeah. Devious. Devious. Look at him. He is devious. Look at that man. Read yeah, his, uh, his bio. Read his bio. A knight serving Ostia. Yeah, very very detailed character. Uh, his spear only has fifteen uses, which means if you can survive fifteen hits of it, uh, it'll just break and he can't attack you. Um, Oh, no, no, not units. I meant to... So not mad, I meant to pick... need two more units. Guess I'll have Chad. I guess Marcus. Why does Marcus have three heal healing? What do you mean? Marcus has three heal staffs. Because he bought them. Um, he also has an angelic robe, which I recommend either saving or giving to whoever has, like, no fucking HP and needs it. So like, Shana which is like every too. fucking unit in your army, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> um, I usually save it for a unit that you get next chapter, but I don't know if you're gonna use her or not. Um, she's a glass cannon, and that kind of just helps her survive a, a hit or two. But yeah, it, it can really go to anyone. There's no bad candidates for the angelic robe in this game. No, I'll save it. I'll save it for now. Wait, can I rearrange units? I can. Oh uh, yes. Excellent. Or you could save it for Lelina. 
That too. Either way, I'm not going to use it this chapter. Yeah, that's that's who I save it for usually. It's Lilina. Rebellion and Ostia. Um, Moon, fur is is absolutely that bad. Devious. Devious. Fur has <laughs> like Roy's say? stats, but you get her in chapter nine. Okay, well, you uh It's horrible. You voice this guy, I'll voice devious. You'll voice devious? Devious. Devious, devious. how is the city doing? They've been quiet so far, sir, but the mercenary knights from Ilya that Hector hired are slowing or showing no submission. <laughs> What's wrong with them? We're telling them we'll pay more. Well, Ilya's mercenary knights are known never to betray their masters. You fool. I know that. General Narshan is going to arrive soon. Oh my god, are we gonna kill that guy? No. Damn it. <laughs> if we don't have Ostia under our control by then, he'll laugh at us. Kind of shows my mindset that I'm upset that I can't kill a person. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I like killing people, so, you know, I, I kind of understand, but. Dude, compare fur to Kate. You're telling me fur is worse than Kate? Is that true? I don't know any of these. No. People. Fur is fur and Kath are about equal in terms of uselessness. I don't use either of them in any playthrough. They're Interac both horrible. My interactions with Kath have uh, she gave us advice and then she just I, I I don't know her dialogue just like maybe just weirded me out. We may have to use the Lena to bargain with the mercenary knights. If we use her as a hostage. Bro, she is a hostage. They should surrender to us. But that must be a last resort. We'll fight them ourselves with the help of the Dragon Knights sent from Burn to crush Ilya's forces. Devious, I want you to clear out the town and guard the castle gate. I will defend the inside of our castle. Are we going to show off the arena? Uh... I assume the reader works in this game like it does in from Thracia. Um, yes. And also like every other game, except that that's not FE4. Yes, sir. Yes. Merlinus, around how many of Ostia's troops have joined the rebellion? Quite a few, I'm afraid. They have forgotten their loyalty towards Lord Hector, and are simply flocking towards one with more power, which is Burn. How disgraceful! I see. You have to wait until later to activate Yidus to lead this protocol on Narshin. Damn it. There's a band of mercenaries from Ilya that are willing to join forces with us and attack the rebels. Mercenary knights from Ilya? Yes! Safe state before then? Do it? Okay. They said that they signed a contract with Lord Hector. No, don't, don't would... save state before the arena. Not Use good. it if you feel like you need to, but... I do. I, I, I at least want to see the arena. No matter how much I hate the you arena, can always, I'll just, I'll You can always press B to back out of it. I'll No matter how much I hate the arena, I'll demonstrate. Do you think it's possible for us to officially hire them into our service? I would have thought so too, Master Roy. However, they already knew of Lord Hector's death. They offered to fight alongside us anyway. Why did they go that far? When they are mercenaries... Ilya is a snowy area with harsh temperature, so the land isn't very arable. Therefore, sending out mercenaries to fight for pay is one of Ilya's main sources of in economic input. I've also heard that mercenaries from Ilya put trust over anything else that they never that they never betray their employers. The rumors are true, I see. Then they should be powerful allies. Yes, fortune is still with us, Master Roy. But I heard from the mercenary knights that one of the three dragon lords is coming here with a legion of dragon knights. If they should join the rebels, then our chances of defeating them would be extremely slim. Roy, what are you going to do? The kingdom of Etruia uh, might join us. Etruia? Am I saying that right? Uh, right? Etruria. Would that be possible? General Sel... Uh, Sel so like uh, Celia, Cecilia. God damn it! I don't know why I was 
uh, messing that. Generally, because you're really bad at names. I'm also bad at reading. I thought we agreed. Also I thought true. we agreed that I'm partially illiterate. You partially. <laughs> All right. I have a feeling that Brother she in Christ, would be I don't think you know what a book is. Oh, I hated books. Like, you ever just, like, uh, go to, like, go to dread going to English class because they're gonna a ask you to, like, read a book and then do a report on it by the Tucker, end of the semester? No. No. No, no, I, I have never felt that way. Actually, like, literally zero times. So you're telling me you enjoy doing that in, uh, in English class? Yes. Because okay. I'm a normal person. Okay, I'm glad you enjoy it. I just did not like reading in general. What's wrong with you? What do you mean? What's wrong with me? No, I, no, I didn't like to. I didn't like reading. Yeah. How do you not like reading? What do you mean? How do I not like reading? Because every book I ever read, I didn't. Okay, I okay. I enjoyed watching more than I enjoyed reading. So that's number one. Number two is that every book I ever read just like put me to sleep. Nickton is clear you didn't start unhinged. sight reading by age three and a half. <laughs> so would that make Nickton a b bomb where if he reads a sign in Mario 6? <laughs> you know what? Yeah, Andrew, I am a b bomb. If I have to read a sign, I will explode. Good. Nuke Nick. Like, thanks. Like, zoink scoobs. Can I access the storage from in here? Because I... Uh... It's gotta be a fire tone, right? Yeah, there we go. Thank God. This, this is the torch staff. Oh, cool. We have a option for fog of war now. You also have an option for training uh, staff rank and getting experience for free. True, though. Fuck, I could put Marcus through the arena. In that because, case, yeah. Yang is in that case Yang is a Koopa Troopa. I am, actually, yeah. Thank you. In what regard? All of them, actually, yeah. Um, Are you the blue them. Koopa Troopa that makes Yoshi's fly? No, 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 no. I, I'm, I'm uh, just like the the red ones. So you spit fire? No, no, no. I make Yoshi spit fire if he eats me. Um, but it, normally I just, I don't walk off of cliffs. That's, that's like my thing. I don't walk oh, off Oh, right. All know? the, cause like all the Koopa yeah, Troopas yeah. in Super Mario will just like walk, will walk off the cliff. Yeah, well, except for the red ones except in, in the, the original Mario. Except for the, the, the red ones, yeah. And I think the blue ones yeah. too. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm a red Koopa Troopa. Absolutely. hundred percent. They should put Koopa in Smash Bros. Um. No, not Piranha Plant. No, like, I think Koopa Troopa is a genuinely, like, iconic enemy that you could genuinely make Musa out of. Um, Honestly, whereas Piranha like, Plant I... is funny, but but not it's not Koopa level. You know, you see Koopa, you think, oh yeah, that's a that's a turtle. Mario's gonna stomp it. Thinking of moveset wise, the first thing that came to mind when you said that is like I went to Mario Power Tennis just to think of a moveset because Koopa Troopa is. Koopa Chua being a turtle in that game, he's one of the fastest characters because he just, like, withdraws and then spins around well, with his Yeah, because uh, Koopa the Quick. Oh, yeah, Koopa the Quick. Yeah, the turtles in Mario are fast. Oh, green units. <laughs> yeah, I love Noah and Trent. Noah and Trent, that just... It looks like the Lyshi Alliance have started attacking the rebels. Who, wait, who's Noah, who's Trent? Um, so Zealot is the guy on the right, and, or sorry, Trek, not, not, uh, Trent. And Trek is the guy on the left. Trek just looks like Marty if he had better hair. Yeah, he does. I love him. Um, anyway, you recruit both of them by talking to them with Roy. Okay. Or sorry, um, you can recruit 
Zealot by talking to him with Roy or Trek. And you can recruit Trek by talking to him with Roy or Zealot. I see. Yeah. Will do, sir. Yeah, Zealot's busted. <laughs> Wait, where's Noah? Um, I think he went to the arena a while ago. Yeah, because he got a crush on a child. Okay, so we have to go in the arena to get Noah, right? <laughs> no. That Noah, a coach? That's unusual. Well, no matter. No, he just comes out next turn. Oh. Once he finds out that we're attacking the rebels, he'll catch up to us. Yep. Alright, let's go. Anyway, you should look at Zealot's stats, because he's uh, the next actually good unit that you get. Hold on a second, let me... It's getting dark in my room. I'm gonna turn my lights on for a sec. Imagine having your uh, lights on would never be me. Okay. Let there be light! I'm gonna... Uh, only got one use of it left. Oh, Roy. Roy sucks. <laughs> okay, sorry, I'll look at... Uh, okay, Zealot. It's Paladin. Steel He's a Paladin. Steel, steel Sword Steel Lance. Holy crap, I'm already in love. <laughs> Yeah, he's really good. He's really, really good. Even Trek's and, uh, not that bad. Trek is also really... Yeah, Trek's nice. Um, mounted units in this game are fucking disgusting. Um, by it's the end of this game, your your army is going to be like eight mounted units and two wyvern knights. It's going to be great. So basically, you're saying I'm playing FE4 again. Oh, I was going to say you're playing three houses again, but yeah. Compare Zealot to Marcus. Oh, okay. Uh huh. Well, Zealot already ha Zealot has higher. Uh, Zealot has higher strength than Marcus does. <laughs> Andrew, I'm sorry. Actual stats? Literally impossible. Oh, yeah, I could just do that. Oh, thank God. That horse looks like an overgrown donkey. A little bit. No, a little well, it's not bit. a horse. Oh. It's not a horse. I told you. I'm sorry, just we looks... don't we don't know what it is. It just um, looks like that. But it's it's not a horse because it's not affected by horse layers. Yeah, Nick, is this not literally just that one chapter from Thracia? Uh, yeah, it kind of is. Honestly, <laughs> it looks. Right after you get a monster, actually, wait, literally no, this. No, no, this... it's literally this chapter. No, yeah, no, that, yeah, like I'm looking at this right now. <laughs> Aside from like a few like like uh like fences in the way, like this is literally just the Thracia chapter six when you escape the <laughs> when you escape the monster prison. It's, it's the same chapter. <laughs> We get uh, the sword. <laughs> I helped the dude and he it. gave me a killer sword. Wow. <laughs> you can't use it, but it's still something. <laughs> this game is so goofy. Yeah, this, this game exists. <sighs> this game exists. <laughs>
One thing we could definitely use more of is lances. Yeah. Huh, the, the wyvern the wyverns actually look pretty decent. They're sprites, I mean. Oh, they're great. I love the wyverns. Keep in mind, Nick, depending on who has more experience other than the others, it will determine the path you're going from on from chapter 17 to 20. Alright, I'll keep that in mind. Yeah, so if your Pegasus Knights have more experience, you get Ilya. If your uh, Nomads have more experience, you get Sakai. Now, what was it? Uh, I said, like, I would choose, like, a pawn there, but, like, what were, like, uh... Like, you and Aaron actually discussed this on which, uh, which route we were taking. Okay, so... Aaron really wanted you to go Sakai, or to go Ilya, because it's usually considered the better route. Um, I wanted you to go Sakai because it's the funnier route. That already worries me that you, you say funnier. <laughs> No, no, no. Sakai is really funny because it's all art. It's all uh, bow knights. It's all bow knights. Yeah, it's all bow knights. It's all bow knights. You know, Lin's uh, paralog from yeah uh, engage. Um, that's part of the Sakai route. Wait, do we get to see Lin in Sakai? No, Lin doesn't exist. <laughs> she, she's literally not real. <laughs> Looks like they've started attacking the rebels. Well then, Fur, I should get going soon. Sakai, Sakai route is nothing but nomads. And thank you for Yeah, no it's literally you, nothing Noah. but nomads. It's so funny. No problem. Um, Ilya route is nothing but Pegasus Knights, so... So, bring Wolt if he's still alive by then. <laughs> yeah, just just bring an archer and you've beaten that route. I'm, so, I'm sorry, Sir Noah. It was my first time in the arena. If you asked another person, you would have been killed. You need to look your opponent over very carefully before choosing to fight. And you must not hesitate to surrender if it looks like you're going to lose, right? Exactly. You can always win back your money, but if you lose your life, it's all over. <laughs> if you lose your yeah, if you lose your life, there's no there's no like bringing getting your money back. It's, it's you're just you're just dead. What yeah. are your plans now? Are you going to stay here and work on your sword skills? No, I'm planning to travel to the Western Isles. The Western Isles? Why? They're building a new mine there, and I heard that a lot of people are going to be looking for work there for work. They must be strong people if they're miners, so I thought it would be the ideal place to find people f to fight for my training. And besides... Besides... The Western Isles is where my mother... My, where my mother first met my father. She's dead now, but when she was at my age, she was always traveling around the world training her sword skills. I see. You surprised me again. All you were saying at first was, I want to become strong, I want to become strong. Right? So I thought swordplay was all you had interest in. But you were training because you wanted to be like your mother. I'm so happy to Ironic, because she kind of is like her mother. Um, <laughs> in that they're both really bad units. Also, that was a lie. Her mother did not meet her father in the Western Isles. They meet in a fucking preparation camp in FE7. Uh, and you never go to the Western Isles in FE7. So I don't know what she was talking about there. I see. Uh, but yeah, her her mother is a uh, contender. Yeah, Carla. Not only in that game, Andrew. Carla is a contender for the worst unit in the franchise. Um, she's like, what if you got Roy? But instead of in Chapter 1, it was in Chapter 25. What? <laughs> oh, and, and in order to do that, you have to... Um, promote the second worst unit in that game, and then have him enter the arena in that chapter, which means you have to deploy him in that chapter, uh, and you have to waste a promotion item on him. And he has to not kill her in the arena. Neither of them can die in the arena, or else you don't get her. So it's also RNG-based, whether or not you get her, because she has a ki uh, not a killing edge, she has a, um, what, the, the Shamshir. So, she's just gonna crit and kill him half what the am time. I what am I hearing right now? <laughs> Yeah, what if you need to have RNG in your favor to get a unit that's basically Roy's stats, but um, in, in chapter 25? <laughs> I... <laughs> you don't think that sounds like a good unit? That's... no. <laughs> that doesn't. <laughs> Why can't we just beat them in the arena and then recruit them just like Kulain? Oh, who knows.
Nice job, Alan. That was actually pretty decent. Well, you can kill this guy, right? Wait until you get your last character in this game. Why is... Is it just as worse as Carla? No, um, it's it's her dad. Oh. Or not, not her dad, it's her uncle, sorry. Um, and he's really funny because he has, uh, like, 200 in every stat for uh, growths. Uh, but he's promoted at level 19, so he only gets one level up. I don't know why they did that with him. They could have just given him one higher in every stat and then lowered all of his growths by 100. And he would be the exact same unit, if not slightly better. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just don't understand the point. God, this tactical setting is really fucking with me. <laughs> I'm so used to seeing the times too and the actual damage they are going to deal instead of having to do the math. What is wrong with you? Who uses tactical right, setting fine, in this game? Fine, fine, if you want. <laughs> it's this one, right? Yes. Anyone who plays with the combat window off is an actual maniac. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Yeah, want yeah, to, I, I, want I don't want to know what what things yeah, are. Yeah, I think I would I love. To, I would love to know rather than guess. Oh, I think I'm just about to lose. I'm about to lose Sue. Mm -hmm. Am I? Yeah, probably. Oh, de most definitely. Well, you never know. The AI could just be like weird or something. The AI it could pull a can. it could pull a Madeir on you. The AI definitely can be weird. Yeah, FE4 AI makes no sense. <laughs> Nobody knows it. To this day, we still do not understand how the FE4 AI works. Pfft, he's fucking dead. Dick. These guys, Dick is gonna smack these guys with his dick. Yeah. Look, I just realized Zealot has dicked. a lot of has a lot of experience too. Yeah, Zealot's really good. Fuck, is Dick gonna die? I'd rather have Sue die than Dick die. Okay, there. Man. What? He's using a javelin. They never hit. The world makes you sense should, now. You should know this by now. Hey, Physic. Oh, great. Physic staffs. Chapter 7, the enemies already have Physic staffs. I mean, that's not out of the ordinary. I've had Physic uh, tomes in chapter, uh, in, like, lower chapters in three houses before. True. Yeah, they're not, yeah, they're not staffs. They're tomes. No, I think they're just spells. Oh, yeah, spells. Yeah. There, is that what you wanted to see? Yeah, that. look at that. That's so much better. I just like seeing the defense, alright? You can see that in the unit stats screen. It, you can literally press R on any unit. I, I like that you're just not recruiting Noah. Oh, I thought Roy had to talk to him. Uh, Roy, Zealot, and Trek can all talk to him. Yeah, Roy is currently uh, right here. Yeah, Zealot and Trek can also do it, though. So <laughs> Trek is right there, and he's just not talking to him. Fucking abandoned him. Oh, no, you haven't recruited those two either. Never mind. <laughs> what, what world are you in right now? <laughs> oh, I just see uh, uh, Lance Knight on the top left of the screen right now, and I was like, that's got to be Trek, right? Um, that's Alan, right? Oh, uh, yeah, that is Alan. Yeah. Nope. Yeah, that's Rip all. Lance. Cal <laughs> Rip Lance. <laughs> like, why would you give the guy with the best growth rates in the game and you only use him for, like, three chapters? Heck, it's worse because you need to have Fur or B or Barter to get Barter to get him. Um, not only that, why would you give him one level? You give him the best growth rates in the series and then you give him one level to actually use those growths, like... At least make him a low-level unit, that way he gets to use those and, like, you get to see cool numbers. 
Thanks for dodging, Alan. And his his stats aren't even that good. Like his growths are great, but his base stats aren't that good. So he, like, there's not really much reason to use him in the first place. They really made a unit whose gimmick is that you get to see green a lot. <laughs> one time. <laughs> you get to see green a lot one time. Yeah, Nick, I like that you've already figured out the meta of this game, which is that Roy is not a unit. He is a stat penalty to one of your flyers. <laughs> <laughs> That's so sad, honestly. It's true, though. That's um, why it's Roy, sad. Roy, I told you, if you don't give Roy levels in the early part of the game, he will never get levels. Because by the time you've gotten to like this chapter, he's no longer doing shit. <laughs> he's sitting on a flyer's back until he can get to the throne and seize it. <laughs> Zealot, on the other hand, is doing shit. <laughs> this guy's this guy's vibing. <laughs> Ripsol. God. God damn it. <laughs> Ripsol, good man. Better call. Reset, Saul, Nick. Then. Reset. My man, Saul. You need him. How far am I about to go back, though? Oh my god! How far am I going to go back if I reset right now? good question but it's Saul he uh he actually doesn't recruit anyone but it, he's a funny unit and I like him well he's also got a men's staff that's he also does important. have a men's staff yeah okay whatever I can sur I can survive this yeah <laughs> um, houses but I am gonna just, but I am just like gonna start speeding <laughs> up though Oh, it's, it's fun to do a reverse recruitment just to have uh, fun with that character. God, my stream is so far back. No, reverse recruitment is so funny. Uh, I, I love reverse recruitment. Oh, I, 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 know why my, I know why my stream was far back, because I was 30 seconds back the entire time. I have stream open on my phone, just so I can read chat. As you should. Oh, wait. Uh, is that what you wanted? What? Oh, yes. Look at that. That's so much nicer. Now you don't have to do calculations. Like, I'm just going to start speeding up right now. Here. If anybody objects to that, well, I'm sorry, but I'm also not sorry. I guess it's a good thing you're not control you're not controlling it. Thank you, Andrew. Honestly, if speed up existed in the in Citra, uh, would would any, would anyone be okay if I used it? Uh, Citra does have speed up. Did we ever use it in Nekos? I don't remember using. No, it. because it, Citra is glitchy enough as it is. You know what? That is true. You just get attacked twice regardless. So I hit him really hard. Who hasn't gone yet? Oh. It's all good, man. Yeah, just like going through this pretty quickly. Walt almost killed a man. As he should. I love murder. 
Okay, now I talk to this man. You do realize Awakening has a skip animation button on the start, right, Nick? I do not realize awesome that because I've never played Awakening, Andrew. <laughs> That's the other reason why we didn't do an Echoes. Echoes, you can skip animations and stuff. You're one of the alien mercenaries, right? Yeah. And what do you want? My name is Roy. I'm the leader of the of the Elysia Alliance Army. Oh, I heard about you. From now on, is it alright if I join with you? Are you sure that's alright? What? Don't you have to ask your commander if it's okay? He told us to join with the Lycia Ar Alliance Army. That's enough for me. But, did he mean like this? This is a battlefield. <laughs> Roy! Yeah. If you take your time to check everything with your commander, then you won't be able to act quickly in trouble. It's not good to disobey orders, but outside of that, you can play it by ear. I see. Thanks for telling me. This man isn't bad either. No. It's also got a steel sword, which I like. I like this. Thank god, these these wyverns just like F heavy four. They have really, really shit res. Boars, I'll give you the honors. Boars, you fucking suck. Arcus. Thank you. Oh, cool. Longbow functions like that in this game, too. As it should. Noah, can you kill this man? And you Well, you can, but you can't do it in two hits, unfortunately. I turned my phone sound off, and I'm hearing- and somebody was calling me, and I'm hearing it rumble. It sounds like a like a stomach is growling. It sounds like stomach growling. I don't know how to properly Interesting. describe it. Interesting. I don't know how to properly describe it. Interesting. Interesting. This bow user can't count attack. Do you think we'd be able to hit him hit it tw hit him twice? Wait. Alright, oh, cool, he's not in range. But if somebody dies, then well Tani's probably dead. Skill and sp 16 speed. Nice. Wolt lives, but only barely. Doesn't matter. Dick, I'm putting you in the nick of the fray here, but it's all right because uh, there's like two goddamn pal like cavalry right next to you. They'll be fine. Damn, I should have kept the arm. Should have kept the armor slayer. <clears throat> Never mind, he almost fucking died. Almost. Then again, I have a better question. Why doesn't uh, how come we, how come they didn't make it where adaptability works for us now? They never will because that would be broken. That would be broken. Uh, the enemy, the enemies in FE4 had it, and that made them horrifically unbalanced. But we dealt with it. Then again, we just kind of unbalanced them right back, so it all made sense. But still, I would like it if one of our if. One of our allies had an ability that had the, the ability adaptability.
Yeah. Roy dodged uh, a javelin. Okay, there we go. Zell so, like, killed that man. Uh, Roy, are you close to that? No, Roy? God damn it, Roy. You're not close at all. There, well, hold on. Like, there are, there are, like, uh, like, uh, strength, uh, increasing items in this game, right? There are. Not a lot of them, but there are. Well, there are a lot if you go to secret shops, because you can buy them in secret shops, but... Okay, secret shops are in this game, too? Yeah. I forgot some of the other lines, but uh, then it goes... Secret tunnel! Secret tunnel! Through the mountain! Secret, 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 secret tunnel! Yeah! Mans will live with one HP remaining. Oh, he didn't get hit. Okay, sorry about hold on, sorry about that. Still okay. Awesome. The first secret shop is in chapter 16. Jesus. Yeah. And uh, there are better things to buy than strength items, like uh, infinite boots. Andrew, you are correct. We They did uh, leaf, uh, emblem leaf. Yes, yeah, Andrew, there are, on, there are only two secret shops in this game. Leaf and the second one sells boots, which are the best thing that you can buy because uh, plus two movement for a pair of boots is insanely broken. Leaf did have adaptability. Andrew, in, uh, engage. When you watch low turn count runs of this game, uh, they don't do anything for like uh, they don't buy anything for like the first half of the game, and then once they get to the the secret shops, they just buy as many boots as they can, and their entire army is fifteen move. Holy crap! You level up speed. <laughs> That's the most shocking thing I've seen all stream. By the way, an armor knight levels up speed. Yeah, it's a little bit odd. A little. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, the solar is gonna go away. I just want to hit him really hard. So now, uh, Dick will be able to take care of him. Oh, he Dick crit. Dick whipped him with his dick. Get dick whipped. <laughs> Get dicked on, dude. Alright, cool. Oh, good old Lou. Thank God, uh, thank God, fire is doesn't weigh twelve pounds in this game. <laughs> no, it weighs like two. It's it's wonderful. Like I sort like I swear it sucks because like FV4 literally traumatized me with how with fire. Yeah, Nick, just wait until you see how much dark magic weighs. Uh. I would assume dark magic weighs a ton. Um, the lightest dark magic tome is eight. The, wait, the lightest is eight. I hey, think physics is eight, physics and death. I think the next, the next lightest is like twelve, which is <laughs> so much weight. <laughs> 
Good thing we got a phys we just got our own physics staff now. Excellent. Okay, now Roy can uh talk to him. Excuse me, sir. Are you Sir Zealot of the Ilya Mercenary Knights? And you Oh wait no, you voice Zealot, sorry. I guess I did. My name is Roy. I missed that. I'm the leader of the army that's fighting the rebels. You? Impressive. I was expecting somebody a little older. I am here respect respecting the will of Lord Hector. Lord Hector. We've lost a valuable person. He is a true warrior. Yes, and I want to re and I want to retake Ostia for Lord Hector's sake. And, L and Lilina's sake. All right, then we'll help you. As much as we can. Thank you for your assistance. You could thank me after you've retaken the castle. Come on, we must concentrate on the enemy right now. Yes. <clears throat> He's right. Ooh, she can attack twice. What? Crit. It never happened. True, actually. That is actual bullshit. I didn't even notice the crit animation. Crit. As enemies in this game don't have a crit animation, do they? They do. Well, I did not fucking notice it at all. That is... Oh, God damn it. Whatever. It never happened anyway. Yeah. I don't know why I'm freaking out. No, never. Out. Not once. I don't know why I'm freaking out over something that, 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 did not, that did not happen. Because it didn't happen. That motherfucker is not real. <laughs> that motherfucker in the is back not, is not real. real. What did she mean by that? I don't know. I, I've explained this before. I don't want to know because then <laughs> that'll ruin the magic. You know what? That's true. Yeah, fair enough. Lawless Allen, kill this man. Thank you, Allen. <laughs> What were you were you taking it back? No, I I was just slightly confused for a second because I said Lawless Allen. Yes. The major's crate animation is them doing a series a series of poses, then doing the standard animation attack. You still got to show off the arena. Yeah, we do have to show off the arena still. I'm gonna kill that mage with my own two hands. I'm gonna kill you. What do you mean? What do you mean, what do I mean? Oh, What just... do you mean? Nothing, I guess. Oh, fuck, I just skipped that conversation entirely. Nice. Good job, Nick. If I go- if I, uh, do this, will she die again? Probably. You know what? Social experiment. If I go over here and do the exact- do that same thing, will she die again? Okay, she didn't get crit this time. I apologies, Ted. I completely skipped that conversation between uh, Zella and Trek. Well, what did they talk? What did they talk about? I don't remember, man. Yeah, that's on. That is definitely on me. I apologize for that. Proof for heroes. Hero crest. Yeah, that's to uh, promote mercenaries and myrmidons. Oh, into, into heroes. Uh, hero and swordmaster. Excellent. Myrmidons are all swordmasters, and mercenaries are all heroes. That's actually excellent. Yeah. Probably not because F -E F -E -G -B -A can rig by messing with RNG by doing a series of arrow movements. 
Yeah, the direction that the arrows go in when you move is random, so it uses an RN. But I'm not a big fan of uh, RNG manipulation. Just, you know, personally, never felt right to me. But you have no problem. Yeah. I mean, I don't like using it for Thracia either. At what point does at what point does RG, RNG manipulation become okay? I mean, I, I don't think it's ever really okay for that, but sometimes it's like necessary, I guess. There's still one lone Draco Knight left. By the way, Draco Knights, they're flyers, so they're affected by effective against bows, right? Affected by bows. They're not effective against them. Sorry, by bows. Different. Excuse me. Yes. Okay, good. Just doubly checking that. What is up with this f one fucking cavalry? Good this question. Is that is the luckiest damn cavalry unit in existence. Good thing there's not too many enemies left. We're almost there. And at three times damage for flyers when they're hit by bows. Good to know. Yep. Alright, cool. Okay, I'm gonna save it right here. I'm gonna save it right here, and I'm gonna put Lou in the arena. Welcome to the arena. Would you like would you like to wager 760 gold? Yes. Probably will be fine. Press B to yield. <clears throat> By the way, if you sit in the arena lobby for a little while, you can hear some cool music. Oh, just sit, just sitting there without pressing any buttons. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I, all right. I'll take a look next time. Yeah. And you can you can back out and it won't use your movement, but you can just sit in there without pressing any buttons, singing your cool music. He did. Yeah. <laughs> they changed it to two times damage for the U.S. version of FE7. Boars. Thank you, boars. Boars is not boring me. Which is peculiar, because once again, this is an armor knight. He leveled up speed again! Or was that, uh, or was that earlier because I restarted it? Uh, I don't remember, man. The point is, he leveled up speed. Damn it. Hit him again, Noah. Hit him again, Noah. Hit him again, Noah. Let's go, Noah. The arena battle theme in FE4 is FE4 attack theme, if you didn't notice, Nick. Yes. What? Yep. I'm be real. I did not notice. I have to go. I'll have to look at that again. Yes, I would definitely love to but chess key and door keys. Let's right. take another fire tome and I'll get sent to storage, please. I'm just gonna buy one of everything on here. Okay, where's the shop that has the the vent, like the, the, is that the only shop, or is there another one over here? There's oh. two armories there. Okay. What is, where's Alan? What does he have? Oh, a bunch of vulnerabilities. All right, I'm just gonna take Marcus over there. Oh shit. Your uh, trade, Marcus. Your javelin, please. Mid. 
this. Alright, cool. Any more enemies up ahead of him? Nope. There's that one fucking Draco Knight, though. Social Knights, Paladins, Nomads, all those guys are riding on horses. Nomads? Yeah. The spear, the night killer, is effective against. Oh, we got a we got a rider's vein now. Horse oh, yeah. there. Are those, are those wyvern riders? Um, but not and not nomads. Nomads are not affected by it. So you know. Are those wyvern riders. That, that, night that was the lie. Medicine, medicine. What? This cures anything. I said, are those? I said, are, are those wyvern riders with night killers? <laughs> oh no. That's I hope okay. we're not in the desert. That's okay. I can watch Elixir. This town used to belong to Lycia, but now look at it. You guys are out to restore restore Ostia's former glory, right? Then take this gem. If you sell it, it'll catch high price. Ooh. Now, to me, that just looks like an orb for a... Uh, that... that Transforms into dragons, but they're, uh, that's not what this is, is it? No. Okay, gotta lure that that guy out, Spooner, later. He's got he's got a red gem of his own. Zealot, uh, Zealot just murdered that man. Average zealot moment. Well, that, I'm hoping that just gets the gets the Draco Knight to show up here. He did. Welcome to your welcome to your death. Welcome to the end of your life, and I promise it's going to hurt. I think you need to steal that red gem. I figured. But do I really want to put Chad anywhere near that Draco Knight? It's which is gonna take two turns to do. I don't think I will. But rega regardless, uh, the Draco Knight's already here, so I'm gonna try to kill it. Wait, hold on a second. Oh wait, do I have is to battle? Is it this? No, I have. Oh, I have to battle in the arena actually first, right? Is I maybe? Because that because that's not the FV4 uh, battle theme. Well, the, the FV4 theme. battle theme is when you're is when you're battling in the arena. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah, I'm not. Ba I wasn't battling in the arena yet. Yeah. More accurate with this. The red gems are funny. Um, they're really cheap. Red they're they're an expensive tre treasure, and they're worth uh, about as much as a silver sword. Huh, really? Yeah, 2,500 gold. It's, it's not much. Uh, there are other gem colors, like uh, blue gems are more valuable, they're 5,000, and white gems are 10,000. And then there's, uh, in the programming, there are black and gold gems, but they're not actually used in the game. Uh, black gems are worth 20,000, and gold are worth 50,000. He's a really good unit, I promise. His attack stat is very high. I'm surrounded. Um, yeah, the, the Wyvern Riders in this chapter are terrifying. Yeah, so I'm just kind of surrounding him. This uh this is just the Wyvern Rider chapter. In hard mode, there's like a shit ton of reinforcement Wyvern Riders. Um and they just fuck you up. I want I'm trying to get a uh, salt closer over there. Fair. I think there are still reinforcements on this chapter, they're just not as strong as they are in hard mode. Well, I haven't encountered them so far, which is a good yeah. thing. Okay, here we go. Here's some lances. Finally. Yeah. Well, you're in the armory now, not the shop. 
He was like that in uh, FE5 too, where the shops sell like healing items on the armory sell weapons. You should probably get a sword for uh, Chad too. Probably. Uh, try again. Uh, try again. Uh, try again. Having a stroke. You think I'm having a stroke or are you having a stroke? Nick is having a stroke. Nick, what does your room smell like right now? Me. Is there any burnt toast smell? A little bit of copper in there? No. Does this guy have a javelin? No, he does not. No. It's the alliance and a red gem. Not that it matters. You can't do yeah. shit. <laughs> Look at its defense stat, Nick. <laughs> they have like 10 defense. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if he doubled Roy? Honestly, I was afraid of that. <laughs> that he was going to. For Look a second. at his fucking defense stat. This shit's nuts. 12 defense. <laughs> You're not going to steal the red gem? No, I'm not going to steal the red gem. Damn. Effective might. It's really not a big deal when the bow has no might to begin with. <laughs> you know, three times three is only like nine might or something, so. <laughs> Let's go, Dick. Dick the Dragon Killer. I don't know, man. I've been playing a shit ton of ROM hacks lately, and some of those are nuts. More speed, um, more strength. I'll take that. Gladly. Nick, I really gotta get you into ROM hacks at some point. You did for FE4, which I still have yet to finish. <laughs> you the randomizer? Yeah. No, no, no. I mean, like, fully built games. I'm going to let Roy kill, like, this, uh, kill this guy. Only. Fire Emblem Vision Quest, Souls of the Forest, which is what I'm playing right now. Uh, and I've already told you about uh, Code of the Burger King, which yeah. you have to play after you finish FE10. Um, Why FE10 specifically? It's the last game that that game has spoilers to in. Ooh, swords. Here we go. Uh, that game has spoilers for every FE game before FE10. So. I see. Uh, also, a lot of the characters are from FE9 and FE10. Um, that's another good ROM hack. Uh, March of the Armors is pretty decent. I thought you were going to say March of the Penguins for a second. I was like, hmm? No. Hello. No, there, there's a shit ton of really good ROM hacks that are literally just entire Fire Emblem games that people have built out of the engine of Sacred Stones. Okay, hold on. Now let me hear the, now let me, let's hear the theme. Mercenary with Iron Sword, great. Alright, let's hear it. Terrifying. <laughs> Yo, you know what? He's right. I do hear it. It's like how FE4 is, uh, when you're waiting in the lobby of the arena in FE4, it plays the FE1. It just, oh. Um, God damn it. It plays the, um, FE1 battle theme. Or sorry, the F1 player face theme. Let's just take his door key. Oh man, I'm so used to seeing health bars. We're not seeing health bars. Yeah, I would like to see health bars. If all the ROM hacks have health bars nowadays, and like Thracia has health bars in the fan translation. So weird text, not having that in this. Yeah, I know, I skipped the text. Uh, I think reinforcements fall when you open that door. So go around. Or through, either way. <laughs> I think that the games uh, should have more ambush reinforcements. I think we should bring those back and make them more obnoxious. I don't want that to happen. I, I think that Kaga should come back and... Uh, 
send Big Chungus to everyone. Did I, did I send you the, the fucking Big Chungus? Oh yeah, you definitely did. And even, even before you sent me that, I already I already saw it. That's from Code of the Burger King. And that's why I need you to play that game. Because it is gorgeous. Big Chungus, 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 Big Chungus. Everyone ready to charge in away from the reinforcements. Oh, Roy got a crit. Yeah. Society mo Oh, they're right there. I thought the reinforcements were gonna show up behind me, honestly. No no no, they spawn up there. Uh, there's some from the south too, but yeah, the reinforcements will be around from the south soon. <laughs> that Lycia army will be cho shocked when they get hit from behind. Let's not let that happen. Honestly, I vote we don't let that happen. I don't know about you, but I kind of vote we don't let that happen. I agree. Okay, but Chad, you uh just get these chests. A barrier staff. That exists. Also known as free experience. That exists. Yeah, it's experience. You you uh get the barrier staff, you give that to whichever healer you want to give experience to, and then you have that healer spam the barrier staff on someone until it runs out of uses. So in short, Ellen or Claire, as of right now. Yeah, pretty much. That 3% crit is terrifying. Yeah, I have post-traumatic stress disorder now. Thunder tomes are the scariest tomes in this game. Because they have high Which crit. Is they don't even have high crit. Look at their stats. They have 5 crit. They have 5 crit. They have 5 crit, and for some reason, that is so much scarier than a killer sword. Because, <laughs> like, a killer sword, I'm expecting to get crit, so I'm playing around it. Thundertoe, I'm not expecting it, you know? I'm like, oh, it's only five crit, it's not gonna happen. And right. it always happens. And then it happens. Yeah, it, it's horrifying. Main of Darkness has been in development ever since Discord became a thing. Okay, do we just wait for it? Uh, After the battle ends, yeah. Oh, after the battle ends, so I gotta battle first. Yeah. I'm saving it right there. At least I, I think fucking... that's how that works in this Art... game. I know that's how it works in FE4 and in FE5. Lou putting work in the arena. Lou getting us some money. Speed. I like it. Alright, now Good. wait. I don't know, just this. Huh. I guess this game doesn't do that for some reason. So you want it? Here's your price. 1440 gold. Now don't touch anything. I'm not touching. I'm waiting, like I said. I'll wait for like three more verses of this song. Oh, huh. Okay, so it was supposed to happen by now, is what both yeah. of you are saying. Alright, let's, let's just get the game over going. What's in this one? Another rapier! Who does he, who does he have with him on him right now? How do I check that? Oh, Trek. Hey, let's go. Lot. 
Lot's gonna do a lot of damage here. I guess that's our Nephi 7. Dick, whip them with your dick. Right, we're, almost, we're almost there to the, th to the throne room. Once we get there, we'll probably end the stream there, because then we'll reach chapter eight. Hey, Yang, you know what? Been, you know what would be really useful right now? What? What was uh, Sigurd's uh, primary emblem? Sigurd's attack called and engage again. I forgot what it was called. Uh, overdrive. Override. Override, yeah, override. This would be very, it would be very useful here. It would be that or it Gerald's mercenaries, the Gerald's mercenaries gambit. Yeah. Fair and balanced. Oh, you mean gambits? Override. Thank you, Andrew. Contest. That's the stupidest thing I ever. Wow, this is really fun. Oh my god, he, ha he he's gonna attack twice. Boars, my man. Boars is pulling his weight, and he's an armor knight. One hit. Let's go! Also, Nick, did you see the uh, sprite sheet that I sent you? Uh, no, I did not. Yeah, I sent you the sprite for the main lord of the ROM hack that I'm making. I think, I don't know if you did, like, a long time ago, and I just haven't seen it in a while. No, I sent it recently. today. Oh, then I'll have to look in a sec. Yeah, honestly, I nothing, like, half an hour after stream started. Honestly, nothing is scarier than running into a berserker in the, in the arena. <laughs> You know what? No, I no, no, no. The, the scariest thing that you can ever run into the arena is, uh, for some reason, in FE3, there are dragons in the arena. And I don't mean manikeets, I mean, like, legit actual dragons. Whole ass dragons. Uh, so you'll just go into the arena and I'll be like, yeah, here's a mage dragon. Oh my god. Uh, they that... ignore defense and res, they have crit, and uh, they have ridiculous stats. You know what? I don't, I definitely You're don't dead. like that. Yeah, I don't like that actually. That's that's uh, that's scary. In my in my first playthrough, I put um, Aaron into the first arena in chapter three of that game, and the first thing he came across was a fucking mage dragon that one shot him. <laughs> so cancer didn't kill him. It was a mage dragon. <laughs> yeah, cancer did not kill him. It was just a fucking random mage uh, mage dragon that somehow <laughs> found its way into the arena. Feels bad, man. He didn't deserve. How that. did it even get there? <laughs> Dragons are not exactly common in Arcadia. Who allowed them to be there? That's what I want to know. <laughs> it was like, oh, you're a dragon? Uh, go walk in. <laughs> go, go Come in. You're fine. <laughs> Come in. I, I don't know why that's a thing. <laughs> Speed. I'll take it. If this 90 misses, I'll cry. Oh, she cried. I really, I really like when two dark mages go up against each other in the arena, and they both have low hit, and so you just watch the flux animation, and it takes like an <laughs> okay, hour I was and a half. <laughs> okay, I was talking about in this game, but I revoke my answer after hearing that shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that, that's bullshit. Um, that and also FE4 arenas, where every arena past like the second chapter, for some reason, ends with an enemy general with great shield that's at level 30. <laughs> Rip Lou. Lou might die. You're <laughs> Rip Lou. What if I create a diversion? I don't know if that's gonna do much. He's not even in range of them. Whatever. I, he can one shot most of these guys. I believe in <laughs> Lou. What if I just like, yeah? The question guy? is that are they gonna one shot him? He doesn't attack first tier. That spear is one to two range, right? Yeah. Yes. 
Fuck him up, Dick. I will in a sec. I want to get a. Uh, I need to get Dick in range of that, and also Roy to to, to, me to immediately capture. Dick him down. Yeah, I think that Big Chunga should be more fire on games. Dick his Dick his ass, sea bass. Imagine I love if, the big chungus. Imagine if the goon from Dumb and Dumber said that instead of kick his ass. But Nick. But Yang. Did the greatest that? quote in all of Fire Emblem is absolutely Kaga. He would have never made something like you. You must be from some sort of post Kaga game, the likes of which I have never, I, I cannot even conceive. Uh, alternatively, the only things funny in this world are Arvis's barbecue, incest, and uh, uh, the foot leg. Okay, at least we sp at least we stopped right over here. I, I did any not... interaction between Charlo from Fire Emblem Four and Big Chungus is immediately S tier. <laughs> uh, question game. Besides this game, is there any other Pegasus unit as a throne boss? Uh. Uh, no. You sounded so sure about that. Are you sure? Is that your final answer? Yeah, I just, I just went through all of the uh, games, all of the bosses that are on Thrones. <laughs> I don't think any of them are on Pegasus. <laughs> they don't like putting flyers on Thrones. Probably because they know that's a dumb idea. Yeah, but they're like horses on thrones. Well, that's natural, I would say. Have you ever seen a horse sitting on a chair? Uh, Bojack Horseman? Fuck. Is that the horse from Horsing Around? No, it's just Bojack Horseman. <laughs> I, I love Bojack Horseman. Um, 10 out of 10 <laughs> series. Genuinely one of the greatest should, franchises ever made. I should probably watch it. Uh, you absolutely should. Uh, if you want to cry, watch BoJack Horseman. You're telling me I'm going to cry? BoJack Horseman is the saddest series I've ever watched. Like, it's not even a question. Fuck. BoJack Horseman is depressing as shit. Uh, but I okay, love he's it. At, okay, he's out of range of the reinforcements. Which Wait, I did, you, did you not know that? No, I did not know that. Oh yeah, the entire series is about, like, drug-addicted celebrities ruining the lives of everyone around them because they're not able to function in human society. Huh. Okay, I did not... Yeah. Know. By the way... Andrew, yeah, it's a masterpiece. Uh, by the way, Andrew just said... Uh, Andrew just said, uh, you say that, but how do dragons sit on thrones? Um, well, if you go by D&D &D logic, in Dungeons & Dragons, dragons can transform into human shape. So that's how they do it. Better question for you. How do uh, Pegasus Knights rescue people? Because, like, is it because, like, are, are you asking that? Is because, oh, why am I, why are the words going away? Are you asking that because only women can ride Pegasus Knights? Yeah, so I, I asked this in another server recently, and the answer we came up with is that the rider just, like, holds the ankle or the wrist of whoever they're rescuing and holds them off the side of the Pegasus. The whole time. <laughs> so, so, uh, Florina in FE7 is just holding a fully armored Hector by one wrist off the side of a Pegasus for hours on end without getting tired. Is that she so is does, buff as shit? So, does the same <laughs> go for Fee when she carried Arthur from Celeste all the way to Isaac? Yes, yes, it does. All right, I guess. Is that what we're gonna go with? Excellent. And in Thracia, up. in Thracia, they have to carry a horse too. And in this game, they can carry a horse too. Yeah. Um, if you have Thaney pick up uh, Zealot, she'll be carrying a dude and a horse by the wrist, I guess. Uh, the it's only game where that's an exception is uh, is Fates because Pegasus can hold men in that game. Doubles his range, so it's not super effective against any kind of attack.
Yeah, for anyone out there who hasn't played Code of the Burg King yet, go play Code of the Burg King. That thing is a masterpiece. <laughs> just the name, I would say, like, is just a masterpiece. It's so itself. fucking funny. <laughs> the The basic plot is that the Black Knight, who is a Burger King employee, um, a guy comes into his uh, his Burger King and orders the number 15 Burger King foot lettuce. Uh -huh. And he just goes on a fucking rampage and kills everyone in the Burger King and then has to flee. Oh um, because he's under, he's uh, being pursued by the police, and that's the plot of the game. <laughs> I will not let you pass. I am devious, after all. He is devious, yeah. yeah we better fucking hurry before these before these goddamn uh, knights show up. It has my favorite cast, consisting of the Black Knight from Path of Radiance, Charlo from FE4, Big Chungus, literally just Kaga. Um, just a horse. Two thirty-seven hit. Bernadetta, nice. Bernadetta Sanders with the Sands Eye. What? Um, yeah, uh, Ul or Dalvin, but his uh his description is what the hell is a Rotalbon? <laughs> um, Mathis. I, I don't I don't know what drugs they were on when they were making this, but it's. Marcus can't do it's shit. It's gorgeous. I know Zelic can though. Big Chungus is an armor axe, and he has a uh, hundred and twenty percent strength growth and a skill called Unfunny that lowers the hit and avoid of all enemies in his uh in a three tile radius. He has Unfunny, which is just the opposite of charm. Uh, wishful thinking if I could hit another 37. No, you're using a, uh, a weapon in FE7, so you're not going to hit. This is FE6. Sorry, FE6. FE7 is better with hit rates. Um, which is funny because weapons actually have lower hit on average in FE7. But enemies don't have a luck stat in that game, whereas they actually do have a luck stat in this game. Which I don't know if you noticed that or not, but enemies have a luck stat in this game. They do. Their luck is shit. Yeah. It, no, it gets better throughout the game. Towards the end of the game, you'll see enemies with like 15 luck, and you just won't be able to hit them. <laughs> uh, because every point of luck adds 1% of void. So they're, they're just like super dodgy, which is why the hit rates in this game suck so much. What if Merlin is can act as a decoy since he can't die? He can, and that's why I love him so much. I've been defeated, but I can't fall here. Oh, they have dialogue? Boars! Yeah. Turned. <laughs> it's so funny looking. Causing a rebellion <laughs> during Lord Hector's absence. That is unforgivable. His jawline is sick. <laughs> it looks so stupid. <laughs> I'll laugh if one of these guys has the Mr. Clean jawline. Oh. Never mind, Trek's still alive. Oh man, I can't wait for you to get Wendy. You have to use Wendy once you get her. Okay. Now I have uh, Wendy? to kill I have to kill this man this turn. Pretty much, yeah. Nick, are you gonna use Wendy? Uh, who is that? Who is Wendy? Um, it's like if Roy was an armor knight and you got her in like chapter twelve. Yeah, no. General Lagos, uh, please it's be it's careful. both, Andrew. Every point of luck reduces their uh reduces your crit by one and it raises the enemies avoid by one so they're dodgy as shit and they don't get crit as much as in other games more strength for dick and uh, as far as i know this is the only game right. where enemies have consistent luck stats yeah all right we got through chapter seven okay the city should be under our control now by now now we have to recapture castle ostia and rescue lilina mr roy we are currently breaking down the gate to enter the castle I understand that you want to get in quickly, but we are working as fast as we can, so please be patient. Lena. Speaking of Lady Lelina, what do you think of Lord Hector's story, Master Roy? You mean about the dragons? They weren't a myth. They were real. Lord Hector is one of the greatest battle tacticians in Lycia, and his army was decimated in such a short time. Well, Burns' army is among the strongest in Libe. I say those dragon knights are indeed very formidable opponents. Of course, the dragon knights must be tough enemies. Must have been tough enemies. But the real dragons, I can't even be I can't even imagine how powerful they must be. The weapons that are effective against dragons. I wonder where they are. 
I presume <clears throat> they must be the divine weapons. Oh, yes, the divine weapon, Worm Slayer. <clears throat> so if we use those weapons, we can fight the dragons effectively. But I wonder what a divine weapon is doing in Ostia. Perhaps Lady Lelina knows that. I do wish to know as well. Oh, Master Roy, our men have finished knocking down the gate. We can enter now. All right, charge! We will rescue Lelina, no matter what. I hope Next you like opening chests, by the way. Next time. Oh wait, we're we not doing the chapter today. Uh, you want to at least look at the chapter today because it is a yeah, funny look at the chapter. chapter. I, okay, I was under the impression that like uh, we get the, the guy in chapter before this, but like after we beat this chapter, no, no, then you we get, get the guy. In you chapter. get the yeah, you get the guy in chapter after. Okay, so te in a technical oh. sense, we kind of re we've indirectly reached it, although not exactly, but whatever. I'll no, we haven't reached first. it. I'll look at um. the map first. I'll look at the map first. Yeah. Ostia's military primarily consists of soldiers and heavy defensive gear, such as armor knights and generals. With them, Castle Ostia's defenses have always been incredibly strong. For a long time now, the castle has been rumored to be unconquerable. However, that rumor was about to be proven wrong. By Roy, who ironically wished to protect the castle. So, cool fact about this chapter, you get the ability to triangle attack. I do? Yeah, you get two armor knights in this chapter, um, Barth and Wendy. And uh, Boris, Barth, and Wendy are armor knights who can triangle attack. Boris, Barth, and Wendy? Okay. Uh, they, they automatically join you on turn six. I see. Yeah, and then the you also get uh, Lelina this chapter, um, and so many Astolfo. Goddamn, so many goddamn doors. Yeah, this is a huge chapter. But there are a lot of okay. chests. And you, you do get another thief at the start of the chapter, um, Astolfo. He is, I believe, unequipped in one of the prison cells, and uh, you have to... He'll, like, die if you leave him there, because the enemies will just shoot him with bows. And we have to keep Lilina alive to get, uh, Adex. Yes, yes. The, right. the Adex requirement is just to keep her alive. Okay. Well, all, th all that for another time. I mean, I'm, 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 I'm getting, a, I'm starting to get a little tired. I imagine you're getting a little tired as well. Uh, a little bit, yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll call it for right here. Three, three hours and eleven minutes so far. That's, I think it's like yeah, a good size. That's a decent amount of size stream, and honestly, yeah. this stream was actually pretty eventful. Yeah, and chapter seven, the best chapter in the game. Uh, unironically, chapter seven. Once you actually get used to it, it has such a good flow to it. Unironically, I kind of had fun with uh, chapter seven. Yeah, chapter, chapter 7 six, is fantastic. Chapter 6 kind of annoyed me. <laughs> chapter 6 sucks. Chapter 7 is amazing. Uh, I mean, Chapter 8x, the next chapter, the Gaiden chapter, is genuinely abhorrent. Um, <laughs> but that's just because the Gaiden chapters in this game are the worst chapters in the franchise. Can't, so. can't, wait, to, can't wait to hear my friends ridicule me about losing another unit. You're not letting Lillian die. I will actually... Uh, I know where you no, live. I don't, no, I don't want to let Lillian <laughs> die. <laughs> Yeah, well, you can't let so, Lillian so die. Far, I love her too much. So far, slowly getting to chapter 14, Nick. Is that chapter 14 the halfway point? Pretty much, yeah. There's, uh, there's a... Uh, yeah, 20... I mean, there's 30 chapters total, including the Gaiden chapters. How many but, Gaiden chapters are there? But yeah, chapter 14 is just the really bad chapter in this game. Uh, there's eight Gaiden chapters. Eight? Okay, so there's 22 oh, Sorry, 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 sorry. Uh, there's, there's eight Gaiden chapters, but you only get seven of them. Because one happens during the route split. Okay, so so there's so there's tw so there's twenty three chapters, and, and plus the uh, seven, plus the seven guide chapters. Kind of, it's it's weird. There's uh twenty three chapters in the base game, and then seven guide chapters, and then there's a three part final or a four part final chapter after chapter twenty three, which you only get if you got all the guide chapters. Uh, to get the to get the to get the ending, yeah, to get the good ending. That of which we we are going. I'm going. You're going to, to. We're going to do. Yeah, I can't. I can't wait for Nick to get to chapter fourteen. That we chapter have, is we have to the to worst it. chapter in the franchise. All right, but all that for another day. I mean, we're, we're, I mean, we're on chapter eight. We're like we're halfway to fourteen. Oh, yeah, I'm so actually. I'm so hyped to get to that chapter. The chapter yes. is shit. That Anyways. chapter was a mistake. And it, is that like is that chapter is like just usual in one chapter? Um, Nick, Fog of War Desert Chapter. 
Oh god, my worst nightmares have come true. No, 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 it gets worse, it gets worse. Fog of War oh, Desert yeah, Chapter? Yeah, oh yeah, no, you told me about this. Fog of War Desert Yeah, you recruit, you recruit the worst recruit, unit in the game, and if she dies, you lose the guy, uh, you lose the chapter. And you have to get her all the way to the end of the chapter in order to get the Gaiden chapter. So you actually have to have her move, you can't just like have her sit in a safe area. Right. You have to keep her moving, and she'll just get one shot by everything, and she can't do damage because she's a mage with one magic. <laughs> All that for another time. Thank you guys so much for tuning into <laughs> so tuning bad. into Binding Blade today. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I know this is uh, not a typical Sunday stream. It's because I'm going away for the weekend, so I won't be home on Sunday to stream. Regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed this stream. Please tune in tomorrow to watch the Among the Amogus April Fools mod that I am very late to upload, but I'll upload it nonetheless. Holy shit! It's been 19 days, Nick. What the. Fuck. Well, the April Fool's thing lasted a whole <laughs> week. Like, they, they did it for a week, and we played it on the second to last day. Nevertheless. God damn. Nevertheless, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys uh, in the next stream and in the next video. Goodbye, everybody. See ya.